Hey, it's time to rock and roll with Scotty Chi. What's going on, everybody? How you doing? Just got done doing a quick little uh, test live stream with the podcast, and it turned out pretty good. It turned out pretty good. I uh, sounded, yeah, the quality is pretty good. I just got a brand new mixer over here, so I sound pretty damn good. Uh, I'm going to be uh, pretty much just moving the podcast uh Maybe, yeah, probably full-time on YouTube now, because I figured, hey, why the hell not? So, so what I want to talk about right now, uh, this is, yeah, I just want to, this is a ramble, 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 ramble. I want to talk about, um, I actually did a podcast about this a couple weeks back. It was pretty good. Um, a lot of my friends liked it. Yeah, a lot of my comedy buddies. And they want to, and, and now I feel like, I'm like, you know what, I should make a video about this. I figured, why not? I'll make a video. This is the first time I ever did stand-up comedy. <laughs> um, so, well, I got started, okay, like, I started pursuing stand-up back in, what, just 11 months ago now? So, I mean, I'm still a rookie. Um, it doesn't, it takes you a couple of years until you, uh, become good at it. I mean, what is good, you know? <laughs> I'm okay. I'm decent. Yeah, whatever. But anyway, what I'm trying to say is, so the first time I ever did stand-up comedy was actually back in 2016. It was at a funeral, actually. <laughs> I know, it's dark. It's very dark, absolutely. But um, this is how I went. So my uh, best friends, yeah, both my, both of the guys are my best friends. There, it was their mother's funeral. She uh, she passed away. Yeah, back in 2016. Sweet woman, she really was. I she was I considered her very motherly to me and all of our friends as well too that were in our little circle. So, yeah. It wasn't like a, any like it wasn't like a funeral funeral. I mean, there's no like viewing. There's no you know like like her remains weren't there. It was mostly just like a celebration of life. It was at some kind of like at, at like some Knights of Columbus at um at the at the local Catholic church in my hometown, <clears throat> and so yeah, it was just a you know, bunch of friends and family uh, of of, uh, of of their mothers. You know, just coming there to pay their respects. Really, that's what it was. You know, and, and that's pretty much what a funeral really is. You know. So, you know, everyone's there speaking, you know, their final thoughts and final final eulogy, final words and whatnot. It was sad. It was really sad, man. You know, her husband spoke, well, ex-husband at the time, but he, but, you know, they, he still stuck it. He still, they still stuck it out till the end, which is really honorable. Yeah, you know, he spoke, you know, her stepson spoke, uh, I believe her sister spoke, a bunch of other, like, friends of hers spoke and whatnot. Um, and so then I'm like, you know what, I, I want to speak. But I want to do it differently. I, I you know, I, I don't want to, you know, make everyone sad. I want to make everyone chuckle. Because in the darkest of times, we need a little bit of light. You know, yeah, of course. You guys know what I'm talking about. So I get up there, and I... <laughs> And I think the first joke, I, not joke, but the first thing I said was, "Hey everybody, how you doing? Um, my name is uh, my name is Scott, and uh, most of you guys know me as the feral child of blank and blank. And uh, I, I got the I got the crowd laughing pretty good. Went up there, just pretty much just started just saying like just funny stories of like how me and her sons would, uh, you know, do some do funny little." antics around their around their old house because they used to live on a lot of a it used to have a lot of acres they had goats and stuff i was telling stories of like you know just how we used to just mess with the animals and <laughs> put uh sticks and like hay and like in other people's like pockets and let, let their goat eat them and stuff um and then you know if you if you know who I am, if you've been watching my videos lately, you'll notice that I use a lot of fillers, and fuck happens to be one of the fillers, and uh, I <laughs> dropped the f bomb at a Catholic church, pretty much, <laughs> and my mother was there, and uh, you know everyone everyone else, I think her parents were there too, you know, I got yeah, everyone was just cracking up, it was great, and and deep down I know their mother would have love that she wouldn't appreciate that she would have been like thank you you know that's 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 what I, that's what we wanted you know personally at my funeral 
I don't want people being, you know, sad. I mean, of course, you know, they're going to be sad, but I, I want, I, I want, you know, to be remembered. It's like, oh, I think anybody wants to be remembered with laughter and good times and stuff, you know? I think that's how it should be. Um, and then after I got done, you know, and when, when it, you know, we're all just hanging out, having some hors d'oeuvres, just catching up and whatnot. A lot of people to come up to me and they said, "You should produce stand, uh, produce, uh, pursue, produce, pursue stand up." And I'm like, "Ah, oh, maybe I'll think about it." But then I didn't start doing it until f- almost five, six years later. So uh, I wish I would have gotten started early because I think I would be better than I am now. But I was living in uh, in a smaller town at the time. This is before I moved down to the uh, Clearwater area where there's more of a scene, and I met some awesome people, man. Really did. Yeah, stand up's fun. It really is. I um. Learning a lot, still learning. I'm always going to be learning, no matter what. But anyway, that's my that's my little story. It's my little ramble stuff. Yeah, that, that that's it, man. You know, it's, it's it's this is good. This is good. I um, I like talking about stuff like this, absolutely. But I'm glad you guys. I'm glad I get to show you guys now too. What do you What do you think? Do you guys think the story is a little dark? <laughs> yeah, it might be a little dark for some people, but you know, I'm not here to you know. Not here to scare anybody. Not here to hurt anybody. I'm just here to entertain you guys. That's it. That's all it is. But anyway, guys, I love you guys so much. Uh, check out the stream I just did. It's quick, short, just me talking, and then I'm gonna hopefully have a guest on. Hopefully next weekend or something like that. Anyway, guys, like, share, subscribe, dislike, comment. Always ring that bell as well too. Uh, so whenever I post anything. Short wise, I'm a shorts guy, you know, because I love you know he was on TikTok and whatnot. But TikTok's kind of done with with me now. I'm full time to YouTube. We're getting close to that 30k mark, guys. So let's do it, do it. Anyway, guys, you guys have been great. I love you guys so much. Take care, everybody. See you soon.